Hello and welcome to the Darkwing Rigging Project. This is a five-part tutorial series using Blender 2.7 to rig a model of a mech. The skill level of this tutorial is intermediate. You should be familiar with at least the basics of Blender in order to complete this tutorial and I'll be sure to have the screencast keys displayed to help you follow along. The model you're looking at now is the Darkwing Mech. I made the Darkwing Mech specifically to share it with the Blender community. This way you can focus on the rigging and not have to worry about the model you'll be using. Notice the configuration of the legs. They're a little more complex than a basic mech design. There are a number of parts and joints. Also the toes don't point straight forward. The stance is pointing outwards from the center mass of the model. The reason I made it this way is so I can share some of the tricks I've been using to rig and animate a mech that isn't 100% straight and facing forward. If there is any interest in seeing a tutorial based on a straight and forward facing design, just let me know in the comments. I'll be happy to make another tutorial with heavy focus on the very basics, especially if there's a demand for it. You can download the Darkwing Mac for free from BlendSwap.com. There's a link to the model in the comments below. The model itself is free to use for any of your projects, so enjoy. There are several goals for this project, including using the Darkwing Mac, We'll create an armature. Then we'll rig the mech using inverse kinematics. After that we'll create a pose library and store some poses. Then we'll create a simple walk cycle. If you have any questions feel free to leave them in the comments. Also if you'd like to see any other subjects that have to do with building a mech in Blender just leave your suggestions in the comments as well. Please be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel for updates and notices when I upload new videos. Also, please be sure to add me to your circles in Google Plus using the link in the comments for my Mech Designs with Blender 3D page. And of course, please be sure to follow me on Twitter at Jigsaw underscore 73. Finally, thanks for watching.